So if you were like me and you've been having issues finding a game on Payday 3, which has been an absolute joke, then you're in the right place. Um, in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can fix these matchmaking issues, solve them and actually start playing a game that you paid for. So yeah, let's just jump straight into this. So I'm on PS5, so this will work obviously on PS5. A lot of the skills in this are going to be transferable. They're not necessarily specific to PS5. So if you are on PC or Xbox, um, feel free to watch and I, I hope that these tips do help you out, of course. So... The first thing, what seems to be happening is you're going to payday trying to look for a game and it either looks for about an hour or it just says matchmaking error. Um, what is the first thing I would do is go onto the menu. So obviously, like I said, I'm on PS5, so just transfer this to whatever you're doing. Um, click the options button if you're on PS5 and just do check for update. And if there's any other updates that have come out that you haven't updated because they've been out whilst you've basically been on the app, then you can just update them straight away there and that should fix the issue that you might be having. Obviously, with this game being quite new as well, there's going to be a few updates coming out over the next few days and weeks. So make sure that you always do that first, right? So if we go back onto the game and there's still an issue, what we can then do is literally just close the app, close game there. Now, I know it seems really, really simple, but sometimes that does fix the issue, right? Um, <clears throat> now, if that still doesn't work and you're still looking for a game, what you can try and do is actually change the settings of the game that you're going into. So if you're looking for a game, or let's say no rest for the wicked, right? And you're doing public, maybe just try friends only or invite only. If you want to play public, change the difficulty. Now try changing obviously the difficulty and the type that you're playing with, whether it's public or friends only. Then try a different map and see if one of the other maps maybe work. Um, obviously don't click these <laughs> locked ones there. Just click on the map that you want to play um, and you might have to just play a different one and hopefully you're able to get into a game. The other thing you can do is if you press the social button, you can find any of your friends as you can see there. You can find any of your friends, join their game if they're um, if they've already found a game. So you can join one of your friends. If you don't have any friends by payday free with, just put your tag in the comment section down below, um, and you can try that. Another thing you can do is disable crossplay. Sometimes this works. Um, so you can disable crossplay so that you're not playing with PC and Xbox players, and you're only playing with PlayStation players, and that can obviously help you get into a game a bit more. Maybe it won't, but it's definitely worth a try. And something you can also do <clears throat> is go on to the Twitter or Payday Free and check if there's any errors with the matchmaking. They'll basically put it on there, which is basically been all the time. Um, but if there's any specific errors and they're completely down, there's no chance. You can just go on there, look at their Twitter, and you can sort of see that. So, yeah, look, I hope this has helped you out. I hope you can get into some games. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. I hope these tips and tricks did help you out. Put in the comment section down below what you think of Payday 3 and obviously anything that you'd like to discuss. But yeah, thank you so much for watching, and hopefully I will see you in the next one.